Have you ever wondered how a single tweet or a Facebook post can potentially ruin someone's life? In this digital era, online defamation has become an insidious issue. It's a silent predator lurking behind the screens with the power to inflict irreversible damage. A single false or damaging post about an individual or a business can have catastrophic consequences. It can shatter reputations, destroy careers, and even lead to legal repercussions. So how can we prevent ourselves from falling into the trap of online defamation? To prevent defamation first, we must understand what it is. Defamation is a statement that injures a third party's reputation. The tort of defamation includes both libel, which is a written defamation, and slander, an oral defamation. It's not just a matter of spreading false information, it's about spreading false information that others believe, causing harm to someone's reputation. There are three key elements involved. First, the information must be false. Second, this false information must be communicated to others, not just kept to oneself. And third, the false information must cause injury to someone's reputation. It's not enough merely to tell a lie about someone, that lie must damage their standing in the eyes of others. The truth, however, is a powerful shield. If you can prove that your statement is true, then it's not defamation. Remember, truth is the ultimate defense against a defamation claim. Now that we know what defamation is, let's move on to how we can prevent it. Preventing defamation is not as hard as it seems if we follow a few simple steps. Let's break it down together. Firstly, make it a habit to fact check. Before you share that eye-catching headline or that shocking piece of news, take a moment. Verify the information from multiple reliable sources. Inaccuracy can lead to spreading untrue or misleading content, which can be defamatory. Secondly, think before you post. Reflect on your words and their potential impact. Ask yourself, could this harm someone's reputation? If the answer is yes, then it's best to refrain. Thirdly, maintain professionalism. This applies not only to your work emails, but also to your social media interactions. Responding to negative comments with grace and poise shows your maturity and can help prevent escalations. Fourthly, show respect and empathy online. Remember, behind every screen is a human being with feelings and a reputation. Treat others the way you want to be treated. This golden rule applies to the digital world too. Lastly, and perhaps most importantly, always speak the truth. Truth is the ultimate defense against defamation. If you're not sure, it's better to remain silent than to spread potentially defamatory information. By following these steps, we can ensure a safe and respectful digital environment for all.